I will explain you a new multiplication technique which is used in our wedding mathematics. Today I am not showing you any method or step of multiplication. Today I will show you magic, the magic of multiplication. Today I will show you a basic trick of multiplication. With the help of this trick, you can solve any multiplication problem within a minute without using a calculator. So personally I call this method as a magic multiplication technique. Okay? But listen carefully one thing here that this method is only useful for the number which is nearby 10, 100 and 1000. Okay? After watching this video, at the end of this video, you will become a magician, a mathematics magician. So concentrate here and uh, try to understand each step. Listen here carefully. Here I am thinking about first problem that is 93 multiplied by 92. See here, 93 multiplied by 92. This problem look quite difficult, but we will make it easy by using our trick. In a first step, we will compare this number with the 100. See here, this both number are nearby 100. Okay? Or this both number are less than 100. So, we subtract this number from the 100. The first step, we subtract 93 from the 100. Our answer is 7. Okay? After that, we subtract 92 from the 100. Our answer is 8. Well, it makes a 93 which is 7 less than 100 and 92 which is 8 less than 100. And that's our first step. In the first step, we just compare this number with 100. That is 93 which is 7 less than 100 and 92 which is 8 less than 100. Okay? In the next step, we get to compartment here. Okay? After that, multiply this number. That is 7 multiplied by 8. So 7 8 of 56. So write this 56 number in our last compartment. Okay? After that, the subtract this 7 number from this 92 or subtract this 8 number from the 93. You will get a same answer. Okay? So here we are subtract 92 from the 7. So our answer is 85. So right here, 85. Okay? And that's our final answer. 93 multiplied by 92. And our answer is 8556. Okay? Is it, is it, we saw, we will make this answer so easily by using our technique. Even you also make it easy by applying this method. Okay? So, watch this video carefully and try to understand each and every step. Listen carefully. When we are doing multiplication of two digit number, or when we will compare the number with a hundred, that time, in the last compartment, our answer must be in a two digit. Okay? If you will get an answer in a single digit, like a seven, six, so write answer in the last compartment like 07 or 06. Okay? If you will get an answer in a 3 digit, okay? like 135 or 145. So write on the last two digit in the, in the last compartment and take a first number as a category. For your understanding, here I am taking another example. That is 85 multiplied by 9. We will solve this example like our previous example. Okay? The first step we are just comparing this number with the 100. This whole number are less than 100. So we will subtract this number from the 100. So, okay, 85 which is 15 less than 100 or 19, 90 which is 10 less than 100. Okay? In our first step we just compare this number with the 100. Okay? After that, we take two compartment here. Okay? After this step, multiply this number, that is 15 multiplied by 10. So 15 tens up, we get answer 150. But see here, we are doing multiplication of two digit number, or we are comparing this number with 100. So in our last compartment, our answer must be in a two digit. So write only last two digit here, okay? And take a first number as a carry over. So we take one as a carry over. In the next step, subtract this 10 from this 85 or subtract this 15 from this 90. You will get a same answer. So 85 minus 10, our answer is 75. And add this one carryover number. So our total answer is 76. So write 76 in your first compartment. And that's our final answer. So 85 multiplied by 90 is equal to 7,600. 
and that's the number five marks. A multiplication of two digit number. Now we will solve a multiplication of three digit number. We are taking our first three digit problem that is nine nine eight multiplied by nine nine two. See here carefully. We are solving multiplication of three digit number. Or this number is close to a thousand. So we are comparing this number with a thousand. It means we are subtracting subtracting this number from the thousand. Okay. So thousand minus nine nine eight. Our answer is two. And thousand minus nine nine two. Our answer is eight. It means nine nine eight is two less than thousand. And nine nine two. Eight less than thousand. Okay. Similarly, make a two compartment here. Okay. After this, multiply this number. So two multiply by eight. Our answer is sixteen. Okay. But here we are solving a multiplication of three-digit number, or we are comparing this number with a thousand. So our in the last compartment, our answer must be in a three-digit. So so this number we write as a zero sixteen. Okay. After this step. Subtract this two from this nine nine two, or subtract this eight from the nine nine eight. You will get a same answer. So nine nine two minus two, our answer is nine nine zero, and that's our final answer. So we get nine nine eight multiplied by nine nine two is equal to nine nine zero zero one six, and that's our final answer. We solve this problem within a minute with a with the with, with, with using this multiple. Take me, my problem. Take me. Okay. After solving this problem, now we are taking one interesting problem. Our next problem is one twelve multiplied by one not eight. See here carefully. This number are more than hundred. Okay. We are same. Similarly, we are comparing this number with hundred, but this number are more than hundred. Okay. So subtract hundred from this number. So one twelve minus hundred. Our answer is twelve. And one not eight minus hundred answer it eight. Okay, it means one twelve, which is twelve more than hundred, and one not eight, which is eight more than hundred. Okay. In the first step, we just compare this number with the hundred because this number are near by hundred. Okay. So one twelve, which which is twelve more than hundred, and one not eight, which is eight more than hundred. Okay. After this, just make a two compartment here. Okay. After after that, just multiply this number that is 12 exam. Our answer is 96. Okay, listen here carefully. This number we are doing multiplication of three digit number, but we are comparing this number with a hundred. So in our last compartment, our answer must be in a two digit. So write 96 as it is. Okay. Okay, listen here again carefully. This number are more than hundred. So we just modify this step. This Add eight number in this one twelve, or add twelve number in this one not eight. You will get a same answer. So one twelve plus eight, our answer is one twenty. So write here one twenty, and that's our final answer. Okay. So one 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 two multiply by one not eight, our answer is one zero one two zero nine six. Do you get this trick? Okay. Uh, please try to understand this trick and apply in your regular problem. Okay, for your practice, solve this problem. Our first problem is 92 multiplied by 98. Second problem is 992 multiplied by 989. And our third problem is 106 multiplied by 114. Okay, try to solve this problem by using our magic multiplication technique. Okay, and comment your answer below this video. Thanks for watching this video, and kindly request to all the parents and teachers, please share this video. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe our channel. Jitu Sir, Hope Coaching Classes. Thanks for watching this video.